we would now like to introduce to you our compares for the day miss kiara sequera and master nathan saldana welcome welcome to one and all watching us out there so here we have our golden jubilee into school competition celebration that will make our golden halo more radiant and rich this competition stirs my poetic soul to recite this poem our earth the earth is ours to enjoy for every little girl and boy so we must always be aware that all its beauty we must share with all the children yet to come who want to laugh play and run around the trees and in the fields so we must keep our planet free with air that's clean fresh and clear for all to breathe from year to year well, so we must never abuse the sweet earth that's ours to use so here keeping value preserve and protect mother nature our creative minds have projected this virtually through the fancy dress competition trash it the relevance of this competition is the need of this art my dear spectacular audience be prepared for a treat to your eyes as our eco friendly entrants on stage exhibit their biodegradable costumes with grace flair great confidence and added up style so your presence lifts their spirits and sparkles to their eyes and then the radiance of their smile will be most breathtaking it will be speak for thy and our universe universally so here they are ready to enchant you with their outstanding performances join your hands together for our unique contestants we now invite reverend father solomon rakol director of our don bosco high school and junior college borevi to address us with his words of wisdom my dear principals and all the students of the different schools who are participating in this activity and competition on the occasion of the golden jubilee of don bosco institute borevi mumbai i welcome all of you on behalf of our management team reverend father tropi isuza principal reverend father jesu robinson our administrator reverend father medford do as a youth animator reverend father renald lemos as a student and also assistant parish priest and on behalf of myself father sonbin i welcome all of you my dear principals my dear children to participate into this events as you are participating i am reminded what don bosco would say run jump and play but do not sin and it is a very apt quotation for all of us run enjoy yourself participate more happily with full enthusiasm and full spirit and i am sure don bosco will bless you don bosco used to watch the games participate with the students and as he was with the auditory boys playing suddenly he would whisper one word in the ear and that changed the life of that child that boy today as well the word in the ear for all our principals so that when they are leading our children it may change their lives don bosco has blessed us for 50 years 50 years of service in the field of education we are one of the best schools of don bosco we are participating in green alliance we are participating in all sports activities and we our school is famous for not only the sports but also the rich values of our bosco which are inculcated in the children in the students 
through our teachers, through our fathers. And we are very happy that we are celebrating this golden jubilee and you are joining us. I wish you all the best, God's blessings abundantly on you and remember always, be joyful. It gives me immense pleasure to now introduce to you our esteemed panel of judges for today. Mrs. McRena Gomes has done her graduation in fashion technology from the SEEPS Institute of Fashion Technology at SEEPS. Andheri, accessory professor at Seeps College, head designer at Maskio for Anita Dongre and and Design House. Assisted her for two years in the Lakme India Fashion Week. Designer at Pitambari Sari's Design Studio. Chief Designer and Product Manager at Burlington's Group of Industries. Assisted in elementary and intermediate drawing exam classes for eight years. Thank you, ma'am. Mrs. Annabel Martins. She is a teacher by profession. She has worked in Mary Immaculate Girls High School for 23 long years. Then she took a break for seven years for her children. Then she worked for two years at St. Francis ICSE School, Barovli West. Teaching is her passion. She just loves to be with small kids because of their innocence, their love and affection. They show towards their teachers. Her hobbies are music, dancing, art, craft, cooking, reading. She has also judged many competitions for schools and also been a judge for inter-school competitions. Thank you, ma'am. Miss Dalreen Cardoz is an MBA in finance and marketing. She is a manager in the risk department in a fintech company in Mumbai. She has a passion for fashion, singing, dancing and hiking. As a part of the Terence Lewis scholarship program, she worked with an NGO teaching dance to the underprivileged children. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. We are happy to inform you that the following schools have participated wholeheartedly in our competition today. The criteria and the rules for the fancy dress dress it competition is as follows. The criteria would be creativity, originality, resourcefulness, relevance and confidence. The rules are use only biodegradable material, use of props are allowed, Describe your costume. We now have our finalist for the fancy dress fashion competition. So here is wishing all our contestants all the very best as they showcase their talents. Good morning teachers and my dear friends. Today I have a 
dressed as a Miss World with the help of the newspaper. Now, let me tell you about it. If you look properly, you will know that I have dressed as of us different shapes. Firstly, I will start from topmost parts of my body. That is my head. I have worn a crown on my head. That is in my heaven. It's in semi-circle shape. Now see my earrings. It is triangle in shape. Can you see my necklace? It is made of a beautiful flower. Now let me tell you my top. Top is square in shape. And on the sleeve, three plates, three circles with according plate. Can this is my beautiful skirt? Made with two in shape. Top is rectangle and down is core in shape. It's so lovely and pretty. Can you see my hand? It is a watch. In oval in shape. Last but not the least, it's a can you see my ring finger? It is diamond in shape. So, all this, all of my pretty dress make with newspaper. Stay home and stay safe. Thank you. Did you think it was your ringtone? No, it was me. I am a mobile phone and I am made of empty cartons and paper. And can you see these? These are my headphones and they are also made with the remaining empty cartons and paper. Come, let me tell you something more about me. I am a mobile phone, the need of the art. Every child needs one, there is no age bar. You need me to attend class, you need me to learn dance, you need me to play at times, or you can't go out no chance. I am very useful these days, no one can ever resist. But use me very carefully or you have to visit an ophthalmologist. You can call someone special or be that special one. Spread a kind word or a praise to each and every one. Thank you. Hello everyone. I am a medical story device and used to inject and withdraw fluid from the body. I have an eye right on top of me, yet I cannot see. Can you guess what my? I think you might have guessed it right. I have a syringe. I was created by an Iraqi Egyptian surgeon, Dr. Abu Al Qasim Amal Ibn Ali Al Mawsi, in the 9th century. My body comprises of all even or barren and the plunger. But today I stand before you all made up of biodegradable materials. My sculpture is made out of bamboo and chart paper. In times of such a pandemic situation, I stand of great importance. So please hear me what I want to say. Though I give you break your pain, but trust me you shall always gain a supply of which will strengthen your stability. It's time to grab your jab right now. So let's all line up in a queue. For this life saving vaccine is just done for you. There is a complete gratitude with no attitude. Hello everyone. Can you guess who am I? And where do I come from? And guess? 
Judges and teachers. My dress is inspired by the element of fire. It is 100% amid and completely biodegradable. The top is made out of paper. The skirt is made out of fabric. Now I may leave you with a fiery mess. Have a dream. I hope will come true 
that you're here with me, and I'm here with you. I wish that the earth, sea, the sky, a purple would send me someone to love. Thank you. Hello everyone. Do you know who am I? Ting 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 ting. Yes, you're correct. I am a newspaper. I carry news of the world. rocket and go zoom in the sky. Yes, you have guessed it right. Today, I've dressed up as an astronaut, means a space traveler. I travel to space to study the universe. I wear a space suit to protect myself in space. I carry an oxygen cylinder. Because there is no oxygen in space, we work very hard to launch the satellite and to make our country proud. Friends, the helmet that I'm wearing is made out of paper mesh. Then my box is made out of unused boxes. Then my buttons are made out of bislary bottles cap. Then my pipe is made out of water pipes. Then my oxygen cylinder is made out of bislary bottles. And then my shoes is made out of paper. Thank you. Congratulations to all the participants. We now request our first judge for today to speak about her judging experience. I would like to thank 
the management teachers of Don Bosco High School for giving me this privilege and honor to judge their fancy dress competition in its golden jubilee year. During this span of time, it is praiseworthy to note that each contestant displayed their costume very confidently and brought out the essence of both the dressing and the act performed. It has been a very enlightening experience to judge. I can very well imagine the parents planning, dedication and the anxiety to ensure that their child performs well. Let me state very honestly, each contestant put in their best effort and a fine display of talent. Congratulations and proud of you, my little children. Each of you, my dear sweethearts, are winners in your own way. I was amazed at the creative talent all of you have and the work put in to make this fancy dress competition a pure joy to judge. Love, God bless you all, parents, teachers and my dear children. What a marvelous performance. Thank you. We now call upon our second judge to share some tips. Good day everyone. I would like to take this opportunity to congratulate Don Bosco High School Burubli on 50 golden and glorious years. And I would also like to thank Reverend Father Floyd D'Souza, Mrs. Grenita Machado and the teaching staff for giving me this opportunity to judge these young and creative participants to showcase their talents through this virtual world. My dear children, life has become a race where everyone wants to or is desperate to win. But remember this, winning has a value for the ego, but participation has value for life. Winning is a good thing and also admirable. But understand that participation is very important. Congratulations to the participants, their parents and to the winners for their fantastic costumes and performances. Thank you, take care and God bless. Thank you ma'am. Brace yourself now audience. Here are the winners for the day. I now request our third judge for today to declare the winners. In third place, we have Nelvina Mendonca from Convent Girls High School, Prabhadevi. In second place, we have Mia Godino from St. Anne's High School, Malad. And the winner is... In first place, we have Aidan Lewis from Don Bosco High School, Matunga. We now invite Reverend Father Flori de Souza, the principal of our school and junior college, to address us with a few words. It gives me immense joy to address you as our school hosts a series of competitions to mark the Golden Jubilee celebration of our school. Don Bosco High School Barangay was instituted in the year 1970 and uh, as we were nearing the Golden Jubilee celebrations, we had planned a series of events and competitions to mark this joyous occasion. But unfortunately, the pandemic played a spoiled sport and we were unable to execute all those events. Nevertheless, our enthusiasm was not diminished 
we decided to go online and organize these competitions online. At the start, when I met with the team, we were a little apprehensive whether we would get any response at all. But today, looking back, I can say that we were wrong. We have been astounded by the response and the support that we have received and the entries that we have received. We have received entries for these events, these online competitions, not just from the city of Mumbai, not just from our Don Bosco schools, but also schools that are not Salesian. And we have also received entries from across Mumbai, from across our country. My sincere, heartfelt appreciation to the principals, the teachers in charge of the different schools that have participated in this event. I thank also the parents and the students for their enthusiastic support and participation and for having trained so well to make these events a great success. I also sincerely want to thank our teachers who are involved in the planning in the execution of these several events. It's not been very easy. They are the ones who instilled the confidence in me to go ahead with these events. And they have worked day and night planning, getting in touch with different people and uh, seeing that this dream that we had comes to its fruition. A sincere word of thanks to teacher Cheryl, teacher Jolinda, teacher Cordelia. They were the brains behind the, this, these events and competitions. I thank uh, our computer teachers, teacher Priyam and uh, teacher Yogita for putting the videos together and for rendering the videos and giving all the necessary effects. They too have worked very hard. Last but not the least, a sincere word of thanks and appreciation to our judges and uh, not just the schools, but also our judges from all across, not just the city of Mumbai, but also India and there are a few from abroad as well. I want to thank our judges for being obliged and accepted our invitation to judge this event. I know it's not been very easy, and but nevertheless, uh, you accepted, you have done a fantastic job. I can't thank you enough. And uh, all I can say is God bless you and definitely St. John Bosco will definitely bless you and bless your families. Thank you once again and God bless you all. Thank you, Father Principal, for those kind words. We are happy to inform you that our Golden Jubilee Inter-School Fest has been a fruitful and an amazing experience for us all. We did not foresee that despite this pandemic and all its challenges, we were able to successfully showcase our virtual inter-school online competition to you all. It gives us immense happiness that we were able to connect with you all virtually via this YouTube platform and showcase the talents of the students from various schools. This competition has indeed been a grand success with the cooperation of various people who we would like to express our gratitude to through the short vote of thanks. On behalf of the teachers in charge of the Golden Jubilee celebration, Mrs. Jolinda De Silva, Mrs. Cordelia Cardos, Mrs. Cheryl De Souza, and Ms. Priyam Nagadia, the students of Don Bosco High School and Junior College Burivli, we thank all of you for being a fabulous audience and making this virtual program a memorable one for us all. 
we are especially thankful and we would like to express our gratitude to our management team coordinators of the different sections for their constant guidance and support your constant motivation and appreciation really encourages us all to give our best we are especially grateful to our esteemed panel of judges for gracing us with their time performances their words of appreciation and their valuable tips and for judging our students so accurately we value your words of wisdom encouragement positive feedback given to all our participants of this event we would also like to extend our gratitude to all the principals teachers students and parents of the various schools for helping in training your children for the competitions held they are awesome performances skillfully showcased their talents and helped make this competition turn into a successful event a special word of appreciation to our fabulous compares for the day a special thank you to you mrs preeti mantri and mrs yogita naidu for all the technical help and for helping us merge and edit this youtube video we thank you for lending us your helping hand to make this program a successful one thank you one and all who were a part of this event requesting the audience of this event to kindly click the like button if you have enjoyed today's show and please subscribe to our youtube page that is don bosco golden jubilee thanking you in advance thank you for being a part of our golden jubilee inter school competition have a lovely day ahead